Your app can plug into every part of the Wix ecosystem. It can display widgets and run code on a Wix user site. It can add pages and modals to a site's dashboard. And it can run your own custom logic on a site's backend. Today, we're going to learn about service plugins, which allow your app to plug into the backend of a Wix site. To understand service plugins, let's look at the checkout page of this pizza shop. While on the user's end, ordering pizza seems as simple as clicking the checkout button, in reality, it triggers a complex process that runs on a site's backend. We can see that as part of the checkout, there are delivery options, but what if the owners of the pizza shop wanted to use their own delivery service? With service plugins, you can step in at any point of the process and replace it with your own logic. To implement a service plugin, simply provide your own backend function that specifically matches the interface of the step you're trying to replace. Also, if you're using JavaScript or TypeScript, you can leverage our SDK for automatic typing and request handling. To both visitors and site owners, the experience stays exactly the same. Only now, it uses your own implementation of the service. The backend function can be hosted on your own server, or if you opt to use the Wix CLI, we can host this function for you. Finally, you can make your service plugin available on the app market for site owners to easily install on their own website. There are many ways for you to use service plugins to integrate and expand Wix's backend. That's the basics of service plugins. Get started by creating your first one today. We're excited to see what new ideas you can come up with.